like to introduce Guy Johnstone and Kathy Johnstone, uh, who together have produced From Kitty Hawk to Kitty Hawk, a fabulous book, mostly in the words of Orville Wright himself. That since Orville had been injured in his 1908 crash and had very bad sciatic problems, he was uh, depressed because of the death of his brother, Wilbur, who died in 1912, uh, and <coughs> bedridden much of the time. Uh, Orville um, Werther told Catherine, they, they taught in the same school, that uh, he would uh, recuperate better on Georgian Bay than any place else. So Guy, well, here's give me some background on why oh, you know. ultimately wanted to write this book. Well, Jamie, I wanted to write this book because it was a story that needed to be told. There were a lot of misinformation around. There's a lot of errors that and ideas that people had. So I just wanted to set the record straight. I get all kinds of questions from you know who were the Wright brothers to uh, you know why why would they come to a little place in Georgian Bay uh, and so on. Those are the, the questions I think everyone wonders how could probably who, a person who was the most famous in the world in his day end up at little, on a little island in Georgian Bay. And uh, that's what the book is all about, how he ended up here, uh, why it was so good for him, uh, good for his health, good for his mental state, and uh, it's the place he loved to be. One of the questions that everyone asks me, that a lot of people ask me, is how did he pass his time? And obviously they've never had a cottage when yes. they ask that. Yes, or, or, or spent any time on Georgian Bay. He was busy all, all the time. time. Uh, and you know, I listed one time, I did a whole page of things that he had to do, most of them that we wouldn't have to do now uh, in cottage life. And cottage life keeps us busy as busy as we can be. All the time. So there, were, there certainly was lots of activity. Now throughout the whole writing process, uh, the accumulation of information, did you ever think it would turn out looking as good as it does? No. <laughs> <laughs> I had hopes that it would turn out really well, but uh, no, I'm glad that I found the fellow who designed the book for me and uh, yep. very experienced person and we're very, very happy.